the reason why this people's walking around with the big chains and the Lamborghini in the back, it's not from actual cybersecurity. It's from actually selling you the course and signing you up to a boot camp. <laughs> going to need a company to come in and give you a job. You're always going to have to get certifications. And if you that's something that you want to go on, you could go on. I know a lot of people that have been going on, on the cybersecurity run and end up coming back to codingphase.com because that run, it didn't go as planned. It's not like what people tell you online. The same way how people come in and be like, well, you know, you could work at Google tomorrow. And if you go through this boot camp. So sometimes these people have been brainwashed. They love that shit. Because there's a whole community on Instagram of like Instagrammers who do a whole bunch of bullshit. I was thinking you were balling with your little comp to your courses, sir. I don't know if that's a, a sneak diss. I don't really know how to interpret the tone of that comment. Am I balling off of selling my IT courses? If that means I'm able to do that as a full-time job, no. No, I'm not. But do I make a pretty little penny off of selling my IT courses? You damn right I do. But that's still not enough for me to just quit my job and do it full time. I don't know the overall tone, you know what I'm saying? Because you're over here talking about your little CompTIA courses. Those little CompTIA courses that I sell have helped plenty of people get certified. Plenty of. Them. Matter of fact, I just started keeping track of it not too long ago. So I can be like, yeah, I've helped X amount of people. JM, do you have any courses of your own that you offer and sell that have helped people get certified so that they can go out there and get an IT job? I mean, if you have, please enlighten me and let me know. But I just think it's a little weird. Maybe I'm, I'm reading into this too much, but it's just the interesting use of your words. You thought I was balling off of my little CompTIA courses. Well, my little CompTIA courses have helped quite a few people actually make six figures in IT. As a matter of fact, I got a student, a former student of mine is that he started off two and a half years ago making like $12 an hour working at the local grocery store. Two and a half years later, after learning these little CompTIA courses that I push and sell, he just got a job offer for like six figures. I think my little CompTIA courses are actually helping people out, going from $12 an hour bagging up groceries to getting job offers for $100,000 in just two and a half years. Now, if you got something that's comparable to what I do, where you can be like, hey, I put this information out here for free, or I package it up and sell it, and this is the results that come about of my courses that actually help people get into position, put more money in their pocket, become upward mobile, then by all means share your little courses. But the little courses that I share have been proven to put money in people's pockets by getting them jobs. So I don't think my courses are little in the sense that I'm reading it to how you're using it. But whatever, let's get to it. And if you, that's something that you want to go on, you could go on. I know a lot of people that have been going on, on the cybersecurity run and end up coming back to codingphase.com because that run, it didn't go as planned. It's not like what people tell you online. The same way how people come in and be like, well, you know, you could work at Google tomorrow. And if you go through this boot camp, so sometimes these people have been brainwashed. They love that. There's a whole community on Instagram of like Instagrammers who do a whole bunch of bullshit. And same thing as TikTok, especially in the, the black and Latino community. There's a bunch of dudes where the big chains, the, the Lamborghini, there's another one. Hey, I'm in, I'm in Atlanta in, in my condo and this, this and that. So they sell this mentality, this, this dream to these people. And they think that they're going to be doing that, that they're going to be earning 200, 300, 400,000. And what these people don't really understand, the reason why these people is walking around with the big chains and the Lamborghini in the back, it's not from actual cybersecurity. It's from actually selling you the course and signing you up to a book camp that is 100 percent correct i 100 percent agree with that statement you go on instagram tiktok these days there has to be a term for this i'm gonna try to come up with a term if there already isn't one but it's like an it lifestyle trend on on youtube or not youtube but instagram and tiktok of people showing off their extravagant lifestyles because they work at this tech company or they work in this tech position and whatever the case may be so he's absolutely correct as a matter of fact on my youtube about two or three weeks ago go look for the video that has um the thumbnail that says fifteen thousand dollar it courses it was a clip of uh, a youtuber named before the billions who's a uh, an it guy out of atlanta 
and I was on his show and we were talking about that very thing. When you guys watch these YouTube videos, pay attention to some of the commercials that come on before the video. You're going to see certain people up here promoting a lifestyle. They're in front of Lambos, these elaborate houses, private jets. I see it heavy on YouTube. I'm not going to say anybody's name. They promote this lifestyle. Join my course. Course might be 6,000, 10,000, 15,000. Doesn't really give you any details about what is actually in the course that's going to help you land these high paying six figure salary jobs so that they can go out there, get the chains, the rings, the Lambos, the condos, yada, yada, yada. I've been working in IT for 20 years. I don't know of too many people balling out of control living like that. I'm not saying that it's not possible, but most people that I know that are making ridiculous amounts of money in IT, they're doing what he just said. They're selling courses and selling other products. Now, obviously, I'm not opposed to selling courses and products. I sell courses and I sell product, but I think the difference is I've never come on here and I don't have any intentions of doing this, of coming on here and trying to sell you this elaborate lifestyle, meaning I'm showing you what my house looks like, what I do, what I, you know, how I spend my money, yada, yada. First of all, that ain't none of y'all's damn business, but I don't come on here leading with my lifestyle of the monies that I make, whether it's through my job, through my side business or a combination of two or however else I derive income. Um, because the way I make money, I have multiple ways of making money. It ain't just YouTube and selling courses in my job. I got a variety of different streams of income that come in as everybody should be trying to figure out how to do. Because in the year 2024, if you're just living off one stream of income, especially if that stream of income is tied to an employer, I think you're doing yourself a disservice. Because if that employer ups and cuts you loose for whatever reason, what are you going to do to pay your bills? So you need to be coming up with multiple streams of income. So then in the event that you lose one, you ain't out there twerking at the stoplight asking for people to give you a dollar. But anyways, the whole point of this, when I sell courses, I always lead, or I've always led with the results. You take my course, you're going to pass this cert, assuming you do the things that you have to do. Because I can put out all the great, the greatest information in the world, but if you don't study it, you're not going to pass. But anyways. The whole point is I've never come on here preaching IT stuff about how you're going to go out there and you're going to be just living the most elaborate, luxurious lifestyle. I'll talk about how you can make six figures. Even when I talk about six figures, I always try to tell you guys the way I teach it and how I've learned how to come into IT, which I think is the easiest way to get into tech. 99% of y'all are not going to come into the door making six figures. You're going to have to build yourself up to that. But even with building yourself up to six figures, it's not going to take you 10, 15, 20 years to do it. You can build yourself up to six figures in like three to five years. Like I say, one of my former students that I'm going to be speaking to tomorrow, he did just that. Like I say, he was making $12 an hour two and a half years ago, working at a, a Publix grocery store to where he's getting job offers now from companies wanting to pay him $100,000. And he's only been working in tech for like about two and a half years, coming up on three years. So that's extremely realistic. And that's what I've always told people. But you got these tech influencer lifestyle people that sell the lifestyle, the money, the clothes, the women, the trips, the whatever, whatever, to get people to sign up for their courses and their courses be like five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten thousand dollars $10,000. But when you go through and you check out their websites, try to read through the literature, like, well, what are they actually learning? You just get some vague general information. I'm not saying that there's anything wrong because I have obviously I haven't signed up for none of their courses. So I don't know what's going on up in there, but I'm just telling you from somebody who's been working in tech for 20 years, I don't know if that's the best approach. I don't know how many of y'all are going to start from zero, no tech experience whatsoever, flipping burgers at McDonald's or whatever, to now you're making $150,000, $200,000 because you took this $10,000, $15,000 course because somebody enticed you with images of him or her posing with money phones and hopping off private jets and stuff like that. I don't know if that's going to be a reality for most people. The reality for most people is somebody going to get certified, kind of working your way up through the ranks. And then three, three to five years, if you're serious, you can start entertaining job offers for six figures. That's more of a reality than the previous thing.